Hey guys, welcome back to Primetime Studios. Like always, I'm Primetime Phil, and today I want to discuss a couple of topics about the preseason and what we should look forward to going into the regular season. One of the most important things about preseason is finding out what kind of depth you have behind your starters. When injuries occur and the starters go down for a series or two, what kind of depth do you have coming in behind it? This is the problem that we saw last year when you saw a guy like Dak Prescott or maybe even our offensive line that went down. Did you feel confident about the guys coming in behind them? No, and you don't feel that way this year. With all those same dynamics in play, you feel better about a core like the receiving core. If a guy like Amari Cooper goes down, guys like Simi Fajoko, Michael Gallup, C.D. Lamb, Noah Brown, Malik Turner, Cedric Wilson, those guys can come in and play that outside position. And honestly, any of them can play any of those receiving positions. And, and that's the nice thing, and that's why you're going to see a lot of switching around this year is because you have that type of core. You don't have that with the offensive line. I think guy like Jeff Cavanaugh makes a great point. You only have the switching around within the starters, and if a guy like Tyron Smith goes down, your best option is to put a guy like Zach Martin into that spot because we all know what we have with a guy like Ty Nenseki, and we don't know what we have with a guy like Josh Ball because he hasn't even played yet. So with those weaknesses in play, you need to go to your strengths, and putting a guy like Zach Martin that already played tackle in college, putting him onto the outside and putting in a better guard because you're better at backup like McGovern easily kind of weighs in and kind of patches holes and I think that's what you need to do and be ready for because injuries do occur with every team in the NFL Dallas is no exception and you need to prepare for that you don't have that on the defensive side of the ball you don't feel that with this young core the defensive under Dan Quinn is kind of flying around everybody's around the ball you have guys that are playmakers like uh, Parsons that he just given permission to just kind of fly around you do have your assignments but he has a little bit more lenience compared to a guy like Jalen Smith where you have to kind of put him more into his position or he's not going to make the play that's our weaknesses on our defensive side but you don't really honestly feel that if a guy goes down oh we're, we're, we're not we're not going to be the same defense no you've seen cornerbacks that Hey, this is a close battle. It's because everybody's making plays, and that's what you like to see in your defense and, and you're excited about. And that's what's a great thing about preseason is that it's getting ready for the offensive and defensive surge for the regular season. And we can all get excited about that no matter if you're a Dallas fan or a regular NFL fan in general. So guys, those are the points that I wanted to make about preseason. Just like you, I'm watching Hard Knocks. I'm getting invested. It's nice to see it from that point of view because you start realizing that from a fan, you're kind of seeing it from the organization. How are you going to make my team better? If you're not performing, we're going to trade you. We're going to get rid of you. We don't want you here. But when you see it from the Hard Knock point of view, you kind of see these guys with their family. See the triumphs they've had. It's amazing to see that and you're rooting for a guy that you normally wouldn't have rooted for and the other teams don't have that advantage. It's always great to root for a guy beyond football and that's what you're getting into. And it's great to see this team get this attention because there's a lot of people say, hey, I don't want my team getting that attention. It's going to be a distraction. But it's great to see more content when you're ready for your team to win a Super Bowl and you want to look back and see what kind of team you truly had. So honestly, I'm excited about Hard Knocks. More episodes, preseason. Let's get it going, guys. Hey, guys, thank you for watching. I'm Primetime Phil, like always. Make sure you hit that subscribe. And while you're at it, hit that like button for me. And make sure you always ring that bell.